Hello, everybody. Welcome back. This is Game of Scott. We're continuing Inscription. Let me just put the continue card in the the the, 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 the spot, and uh, let's get going. We're in the uh, wetlands, I believe it was called. Area two. We beat the prospector dude. He's a big old jerk. Yeah, prospector's pickaxe still ringing in my ears. All right, rank smell of rotten mold permeated the humid air. Every step forward was answered by some nearby slip or slither. You tread cautiously into the wetlands. All right, what's this little thing? It's a cave with some eyes. You arrived at the inky black mouth of a cave. A strange beast lurked within. It spoke past one of my trials, and I will be yours, in a raspy voice. Three creatures will be drawn from your deck. They will decide your success or failure. But first, you will choose a trial. The trial of health. Three drawn cards must have at least six health combined to pass. The trial of bones. Three drawn cards must cost at least five bones combined to pass. Or the trial of wisdom. The three drawn cards must have at least three sigils among them to pass. Oh, this was a terrible time to... I forget my deck, dude. This is a terrible time to, uh, you know. Do I have the, the turtle with six health? Let's go five bones. Let the trial of bones begin. Wolf? Reginald Ouroboros! No. Oh, failure. The creature whispered as it faded into the blackness. Bag exclamation point. What do I got? Oh, dude, I love me some bone tokens. Bone! That wardrobe, he almost put me in there. The top left drawer. But the puzzle was too easy. The top left drawer. But the puzzle was too easy. So we got flying bees. Okay. Uh, the, squir uh, the flying things would just fly over me anyway, so. It doesn't matter. Give me a squirrel. Me. And what do you do again? Oh, yeah, lose an attack. Cool. Get pooped on. Give me a card. Wolf? Oh, what the heck? Give me another card. Uh, give me a boulder. We need to put it there, because he can attack... Oh, it strikes each opposing space. Okay, I thought it just randomly. Shoot. Well, either way, a boulder needs to be there. Oh, yes. I didn't realize that we were killing them. What? No! Oh, because cause the freak. It, it's a flying creature. It flew over the boulder. I was just like, man, I'm smart. I'm only taking one damage of that turn. I 
Can I look at my deck right now? No. Shoot. Let's grab a card. Minsky? What is that? When an opposing creature is placed opposite to an empty space, a card bearing that will move to that empty space. Fervid man. Ooh, yeah, I like that, though. The mantis was cool. River otter. Submerges itself during my turn. The card bearing the sigil submerges itself during its but while submerged. Opposing creature. I like the mantis. That was cool. Um, Any more bone tokens? Oh, it's a, it's a sigil fight. Oh god, no! It's flying guardian things. This is terrible. And then that. Card bearing the sigil will block an opposing creature. All right, we got bullfrog. We'll put you there. We have pooped on. A squirrel. Put the squirrel down. We got a couple bees. Another squirrel. Put you there. Get a wolf. Reginald. I think we got enough to summon a Reginald. Yeah, baby. Oh, you jerk. You mantis jerk. I couldn't stop thinking about the rewards of the metal sliders. They're, they're a bit like cards, aren't they? Yes. I get that, that idea of it. That was a good... Ooh, what the heck is a beehive? Let's put a squirrel there. I get a bee. Did I neglect to mention overkill damage? Excess damage is not wasted. It carries over to the card behind the mangled corpse of the victim. Lucky for you, sick. That's a good win. I can hardly see the symbol there. We were stopped along the way by a trapper looking to liquidate his pelts. Didn't I have some things for a trapper? There was something uncanny about his appearance, but you were quickly distracted by his wares. Dare to look at me pelts? Take a pelt free of charge. See the quality? You're leaving already? Please consider me pelts. Oh, sorry. I got six. So I can't buy that pelt. I get a wolf pelt. Thanks for your business. The man assured you of the value of the pelts. They appear to be useless in a fight, but he mentioned that the trader further down the path would reward you for them. Cool. Oh, there's my deck. In case I ever get a challenge again. Like, I don't got a whole lot of health. I do got the snapper. If I get the snapper, that's an insta-win. Um, 
what was it? Health, bone cost, and uh, sigils. Sigils. Uh, sigils would be good. I got like freaking. I don't know if the pelts would come up during that challenge, but if they don't, I only got three cards that don't have sigils. But don't you need all three of them to have sigils, though? I think that's the thing. Ooh, do I want to sacrifice a card? And sacrifice the opossum. Plus, I think you got all the items. Oh, no, that's right. It's choices. What happens if I sacrifice myself? Honestly, you might have to sacrifice Reginald. Am I your choice? Well, I don't even got stoke. Yeah, dude, you're your cool card guy. So yeah, go for it. Empower me. Oh, he got two sigils. A stump, and I got a grand fur. Oh, you got a wingfisher. That's the thing that submerges. Ooh. Oh, dude, honestly, that's sick. Put the mantis right here. There's a stump, so nothing's going to attack it, but I can go bam, bam. Oh, baby. Although those, the wingfishers do submerge, so I don't get to kill them necessarily. That's okay. I could put an opossum down. <clears throat> yeah, that's a lot of damage. Oh, they don't. Oh, they're that. They're flying. Guess we'll draw a card. Look, there's a third talking card somewhere around here. Personally, I hate the guy. Biggest killjoy ever. But he's the only one of us with a plan to get things back to normal. That's a uh, get owned, sir. Let's do a blood cost. Uh, one, two, or three. Let's just do one. The Omnipresent Mole. It burrows and emerges to block any landborn attacker. An empty space will be struck. A card bag that would move to that space and receive the strike instead. Alright, that's fancy. Hmm. You can't take more than three items and you have three. Instead, perhaps you'll accept this gift from my friend. It's a pack rat. A prudent pack rat. Never doubt the utility of a well-stocked pack. Sure thing. Thanks. Foul smell invaded your nostrils and caused your throat to seize. A hulking man sat by a brackish pond with his feet submerged in the dark water. He pulled a hook from a pile of rotting fish and rose to his feet. I am the angler. Go fish. Dun dun dun. I assume these belts uh, just give more health. Alright, that doesn't work for flying. Which fish? Hard choose. What?
I can't even do the bone tokens. Why am I being fished? You got a hook, man. Mine now. Hey. I was gonna like, you know, sacrifice that. Oh my god, I'm dead. They're flying though. Can they be sacrificed? I got nothing here, dude. Here, have a tooth. I got nothing, man. Oh, stale fish, hard shoes. He's gonna take my rabbit pelt. I mean, I need a... It's me. I was hoping for a bone card. I can't do nothing, man! Take fish, go fish. That's my second candle! No! Huh, go fish. Not the hands! Hate the dude's hands. Will he let me start in the wetlands again? Stay there, no need to move. Oh, I gotta click. I'm afraid you are not dead yet. Hold still. Oh, you're gonna take another picture of me. I don't know where you put your camera. Can I climb in the floorboards? Leave? Here it is. I'm gonna take a picture of you. Oh, shoot. I didn't read the first line. Do you have any idea what the camera is capable of? Give me that. We have a memento to create. Behold my death card again. Shall we begin to ink it? Well, it could be free. Dude, that would be sick, though. A free card? Yeah! Power and health? Dude, a free river snapper? Sick. Choose a card. Sigils? I'll do one six. What do you do again? When the card bearing this is played, you will receive a random item as long as you have less. Oh, okay. Dude, a one oh. A one six. A free one six of blocks or attacks twice. This is defensive, this is offensive. Uh, let's go offensive. Let's do the mantis. Um Jiminy. Capture my vis visage. Say cheese. Oh, oh a flash. I'm not even playing in a dark room and the flash still kills me. Are you prepared for what lies ahead? To be impaled on the angler's hook like the one who came before? It seems a lowly stink bug has made its way in. But it is dealt, so it stands. Hello, friends. Oh, of course. I'm back in the, the forest, or whatever you call it. No, you may not choose a specific beast. Instead, you must now decide on a tribe. What the frick is a tribe? I don't know what you want, so give me that. Oh, it's a rep. I got a free river snapper. Yeah, I wish for something else. Oh, 
River Sapper's gonna get sacrificed at like the first chance I got. An ancient woman emerged from behind an oak tree. She carefully laid out intricate wood carvings and gestured at them brusquely. <clears throat> Choose. What does this do again? Carve will grow and ooh. Yeah, let's do fledgling. Accepted the woodcarver's offering. It is useless without the second half. But you intuited that this would not be the last encounter with her. Okay. I just got a thing. A battle! Oh no, they're all defensive. Well, that's rude. Sparrow. Sparrow! They're flying and they are jerks. And they got two health. What happens if I sacrifice a stoat? I, I want no spoilers. I, I I was tempted. I was like, you know, what happens? You know, I'm going to do it. Wow. Just to see what happens. Is he going to be mad at me forever? Give me a card. A bullfrog? Cool. Oh, that's right. You're a jerk. Easy first fight. Doesn't matter. Give me a squirrel. Why don't you concede this time? Like, you, you just stopped playing. Is the stoke going to be mad at me next time? sacrificed him. I should have sacrificed him first to see the dialogue because the dialogue just kind of disappeared. Oh, what the frick is this? Ringworm? Its value is not readily apparent. It's not even a fledgling, though. Well, sure. I'll take it. The old woodcarver again appeared before you. Choose... Give me the elk wood thing. Okay, yeah, I'm familiar. The old woman bared her teeth in satisfaction. Your first totem was complete. The fledgling sigil will now be marked upon all your hooved creatures. I don't know if I have any hooved creatures, but that's cool. Let's just do a regular fight instead of a spooky fight. <clears throat> Wardrobe. Sliders. Hmm. Yes, give me more. Wolf cub. You'll live against the wolf cub, so that's good. What are you? Hold on. Oh, dude, the boulder is strong? What the frick? I don't think that's fair. Think bug? Oh, the creature loses a power. So that's sick. Cracking. Total misplay. Alright. No, don't gotta be rude about it. Is the boulder actually attacking me? It is! What a jerk. Yeah, boulder's not attacking. 
All right, squirrel. Let's see this ringworm. It has one health and zero attack. Seems cool. Dude, this mole sucks. You have me here. I surrender. Thank you. Oh. I have the most exquisite pelts. I only got one. The first one's free. I'm sorry, sir. I only have one, too. That's it. Much appreciated. You really just gave me a pelt for free. I didn't I didn't give you nothing, man. Wait, where is me? When do I get me? I have a death card. Oh, I want to do this mining. The fire always freaks me out. One of these times they're going to like take my card, dude, I swear. A black goat. Or bone tokens. Let's do bones. I don't have anything that needs three sacrifices. So, like, what do I need a blood goat for? Are the sliders on that wardrobe a bit like Yes, how to win. Yes, I know. Okay. What do you got coming up? A wolf cub, I dare. A spider? You sure? How do I rabbit pelt? Enough. Maybe I have to put them in. No, the alpha is going to attack my rabbit pelt. Oh no, that's the plus. We can get a squirrel. And then break open in case of emergency. I mean, you can't kill the alpha, which sucks. I can't put them in the rabbit pelt. I can't put... Yeah, zero four. I can't put you there. Masterful. I don't know what to do with pelts, man. He's gonna kill. Oh no, I win! Okay, Stoat doesn't die. Hooray. Alright, mining with a pickaxe. Let's go, baby. You came across a hobbled man standing beside some boulders. Ye caught me off guard. You're not supposed to see me till further down the road. Say, I like me a gamble. If and ye can pick a boulder that has gold in it, ye can keep it. Show me where to strike. Spot the difference, I bet. All right, they all have a circle with an arrow. They all got three little pebbles on the left. I find the difference between these three pictures. They're the same picture. <laughs> uh, Tails never fails, right? Yeah. Oh, it's gold. I can barely abide giving it to you, but a promise is a promise where I'm from. I still know what to do with the pelts, so. Can I alter deck? No. Can I put stuff here? I can't right click the golden pelts, like, see what's going on. Oh no, we got a fire! Oh god! Warm a creature by the fire? Enhance its power? Said a hungry survivor. No. Do what you must to stop this. Ringworm! The fire warmed the wary wingworm and enhanced its power. You suspected the intentions of the survivors were less than pure. With your ringworm in tow, you retreated into the woods. 
<laughs> Maybe like five more fires where I take my card, I will be convinced. Yo, what? No! My boss battles are high stakes tests of your aptitude. With one flame, you will either overcome them or die. Fear not, I will let you keep the smoke. How dare you? <clears throat> oh, the smoke. Chill mist closed in around you. You are not alone. The figure emerged from the fro fog. It's the prospector! Blah, 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 blah. The wardrobe! Mm -hmm. Dude, come on. Give me more than that, man. Yeah. What do you got coming up? You need to destroy pack mule. What does the smoke do again? What's it? When a card bearing the sigil dies, four bones are worth. Ooh, sick. And this just dies, right? So I could, like, sacrifice you too. So many bones. Yeah, why not? We'll put you there. Masterful. Eh, probably not really. I don't want to look up what to do with pelts either. I'm just gonna let the game explain it to me in due time. Oh yeah. Alright, so you're gonna die. You're gonna be eating the boulder. It's just got three health, man. I, mean, I don't know. I killed a coyote, that's good. The mole. But what do I do with it? <laughs> There's gold in them cars. What a big old shirt. Gold, I've struck gold. Ringworm, okay. Yeah, I need the pack mule, like, badly. Give me a card. Easy boss. Just pop that mule. I, I know, man, but he's not popping. I can't just let him attack for five. I gotta do this, man. You don't gotta give me the red screen ear ringing I get a bone card that would just be lovely neither of these guys is gonna kill what do you do again opposing creatures please A stoat can at least survive. Well, no, right? Hold on. Can I see the freaking thing, man? Oh, yeah. If I get hit, I'm dead. So it doesn't super matter. I need to kill both the wolf and the thing.
All right, here you go. A squirrel here. A golden pelt here. Sure, we'll play the ringworm here. <clears throat> Squirrel. Stoat. Yep. Okay. Adder. No, it's killed my thing. Alright, the gold pelt has died. I need to draw a card, dude. I need bones. Rabbit pelt. G dang it. Oh no, I think we're alive. Because the stoat's going to deal the damage right now. The adder will kill the stoat in a second, but for now... We dealt the damage. Bloodhound's gonna kill the rabbit pelt. Where are my bone? Do I have no bone cards? I have so many bone tokens. I can even get more bone tokens. I didn't kill the pack mule, so like that's my bad. More gold for me. So how do I get my card? Because I didn't get my death card that time. So like, I don't... I forget what I did the first time I, I got it in my deck. Oh, the camera's not here. Please try to remain alive for just a short while longer. I would like a memento. Your death card? Oh boy, how exciting. Do I want to cost two sacrifices or two sacrifices? I guess two. Oh my god, my death card sucks. I guess three health. My deck sucked that turn. Balls. Got the weights. No! Not the flash. No, Stinkbug needs to give me more, more clues for the freaking thing. I probably need to progress though. Like he's just gonna keep saying like, "Oh, the the puzzle, oh, the, the puzzle." They fell to a mad prospector. Nothing comes between that man and his gold. Your starting deck. Yo, so have you always had a rectangle head? What the frick? Why is your head a rectangle? This seems different. I don't feel this is right. <laughs> the conniving raven, a blight upon the sky. Grizzly, wolf cub. Give me wolf cub. I want to sacrifice something. This is like first turn, dude. Stone has not always had a rectangular head. I refuse this, right? Alright, we'll try the fire. Just trial and error. Something's gonna... Crackling fire. We have not food. But perhaps one of your creatures will join us and enhance its power. Uh, nope. Do the bullfrog? Always? Yeah, the fire warmed the wary bullfrog. You suspect these intentions. Four more fire pits and I'll be convinced that it is just a good thing. They won't eat my cards. Porcupine. Shoot. Kind of sucks, but put my wolf cub here, honestly. Let's 
So Bullfrog does two. It'll take the damage back. Now we kill the coyote. Be careful, you're close to die. Lucky draw! I think we're fine. Bullfrog's keeping us in. I concede. Thank you. Blood cost or... Eh, just do this. We get the woodcarver here too. Magpie? Fetch any card in your deck. When a card bearer you may search your deck. Ooh. Oh, you do cost two things. Coyote, four bones. I'm actually not sure what that is. Well, of course. Then. Why do we not take the card that even this dude doesn't know? Bows of the ancient woman creaked and groaned as she approached. With gently shaking hands, she placed her offerings before you. Okay, so now we know what we're doing. We get half. We get... Mantis? Stinkbug is a mantis. Mirror. Ugh. The power and equal bearing the sigils. Give me the mantis. I'll we'll figure out what we're doing with it later. A stump and a grand fur. And you are playing two coyotes. Why you got a spider on your coyote? Get out of here, guy. Alpha. Oh, shoot. And there's a stump there. Get a squirrel for the stoat. Kill a coyote. Bad play. You're gonna kill the coyote! Shut up. Play this guy here, of course. Hey, he's got three attack! Okay, so he copies the uh, attack, at least. It said something about the sigil, so maybe he copies the sigil, too. There's just nothing to copy it. Indeed, you jerk. Whatever. All right, Rat King, the tragic Rat King. When their tangled bodies become corpses, you will gain four bones. Cool. The apotheosized goat, the truest offering, sacrificing it, grants three blood. Or the coyote itself. Don't I have a coyote? thought I did. No, I had a choice of the coyote, but then this mirror guy came in, so... Of course. Let me take that coyote. Dude, we're, we're testing the fire. Starving survivors stood around. There is room for a creature on the fire. The warmth will enhance its power. Choose wisely, please no. Bullfrog! Yeah! You withdrew. One of these days, dude. I still don't trust it. Three more times. Three more fires where nothing happens. And then I will believe. <clears throat> Alright, so these guys are going to fly out with me. So that's fine, actually. i play a squirrel. And a wolf cub. And they'll just fly over me. 
like to kill the alpha. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. You got two hearts, so that's fine. <clears throat> I'd like to pull the stink bug so he can tell me more things. The mirror, of course. Ooh, yeah, excess damage, baby. Hey, you can choose to not fly, you jerk. Wardrobe, sliders. Oh, yeah, I gotta progress because he's just gonna keep doing this garbage. Shall we? We shall. Oh, dude, we won? What? Okay. Oh, there's a wolf. Okay. I was like, what the heck? Me belts are clean! I only got two. Have a free one? I won't buy another one because I don't know what they freaking do. You could sacrifice? Or bag? What are our cards? Who do who do we want to sacrifice? Who'd sacrifice the wolf? Oh, I forget. You don't have the choice. The choice is yours. Oh, I don't want to sacrifice. Oh, shoot. It's me. Oh, shoot. I'm not going to sacrifice you, buddy. You're talking to me. I don't want to... I love the wolf cub. Shoot. I, just... I forgot you don't eat. Fine choice. What do you turn into, though, I wonder? Yeah, I wonder what you're going to turn into. We get to smoke. I only got two cards that have bone costs, I think. The stink bug and the coyote. You passed a massive empty bowl surrounded by heaps of unidentifiable giblets and scantlings. It seemed the bowl was designed for a dog, but what earthly hound would require a meal of that size? Where is that hound of mine? <laughs> Boss time, eh? I play you. Goat it up, baby. Bad play. Yeah, probably. What are you going to turn into, though, dude? No, oh, just the stronger you. Alright, eat my rabbit pelt, I guess? Yeah, jerk. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Look how much attack I have. Pack mule is gonna move. No, the adder. Give me a card, coyote baby. Oh shoot! Because the freaking thing.
Hey, baby, look at those cards. Oh, squirrel, mantis, adder, cockroach, my mule, and her pack. Wolf. Hey. Ah, oh, you jerk. I draw my last card. The wardrobe. Oh, okay, I get it. I get it. Cockroach. When a card bearing the sigil perishes, a copy is created in your hand. Okay. Adder requires two sacrifices. Hey, Mr. Bullfrog. Maybe I don't want to do this. No, I guess we do it. I was going to say, all these cards are going to turn into gold at some point. We didn't win this turn just yet, but like... We need to save some cards. And don't play anymore so he doesn't turn. Yeah. Sorry, Elder Stoat and Bullfrog. Kinda sucks. Gold! I've struck gold! Oh, dude, it's still Wolf Cub. Sick. I will stink bug. And play, thank you. Listen to that stoat. At least some people are supportive. How many bones? I got a lot of bone chips. So we'll play a cockroach. <clears throat> I'll die, but I'll get another one back, so that's fine. I got a bunch of fodder until a gold nugget gets dead. I can play some more cards. <clears throat> I still got a wolf, a mantis. I don't think I've played a mantis this whole time. Adder or bloodhound. Kill the bloodhound. Oh, you need two. Okay. And I guess we can kill the thing. Doesn't matter. No reason not to, really. Oh, baby, here it comes. Here it comes. Get pooped on. Yeah. Let me relight your candles. Very well. You may choose a rare card. Oh, this is where I got me, isn't it? Canine hooved reptilian feathered insectoid. The owl amalgam is here. Oh, and I got a... This is good because I have half of the insect thing. Ooh, holy mantis god. Oh, dude, it attacks three lanes, I assume. And it's only one. Sacrifice. I mean, it is only one attack, but it's three lanes. Oh, okay. The Stalwart Mole Man, the ultimate defense. Sick. Yeah, defends against flying and is is is, is a mole. So three, three for two. You don't do anything. You, that seems sick. Dude, give me the mantis. Deals three attack across, well, one attack across three lanes, yeah. Three attack total. After the harrowing encounter with the prospect, you gather yourself and continue onwards. ba ba da ba let me see. The wetlands. Oh, do I need to go to the wood carver? The air grew thick with moisture. The buzzing and chirping of insects drowned out. The sound of your footfalls, you behold the wetlands. Encounter a small outpost in the woods tended by a mysterious woman. It was a traitor that the old trapper had mentioned. Her appearance was unsettling, but you were mollified by her offerings. Do you mind 
if I examine those pelts of yours? <laughs> Let's start. Oh, the rabbit pelts. They're not really for battle. You give it to the traitor here. Man, I wish I could have seen this person when I had the golden pelt. I can trade you any of these for my rabbit pelt. Okay, what is that? Bell ring, represented by to the... Okay, that's fair. What is that? Corpse you, if a creature that you own perishes with a card bearing the sigil in your hand, is automatically... Oh... If a creature that you own perishes by combat, a card bearing the sigil in your hand is automatically played in its place. So it costs five bones to play, or it just automatically gets summoned if, uh, you know, you're cool. What is that? Hefty. At the end of the owner's turn, a card bearing the sigil will move in the direction described in, this, in the sigil creatures, and the way it will be pushed in the same direction. Weird. Creatures in the way will be pushed in the same direction. Skunk! Oh, that reduces one power of the opposing. Yo, Corpse Maggot seems kind of cool. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, what was that symbol? Question mark? We have half of a relic or whatever this is. You can move with a certain vigor. Ooh, dude. Ooh, flying? Do we have flying? Dude, our mantis, our triple mantis boy can be flying. That's sick. When you looked up again, the ancient woman had vanished. Right? Because that's a mantis, dude. You're a mantis god. Oh, no, I didn't want to. This is a mantis, dude. It should be flying. Maybe it's... it has to pop up in battle. Alright, what do you got? A wingfisher. Oh, oh wingfishers. Let's put Mr. Stoat out there. Bad play. It's fine. Shut up. You're always so critical. This dude does defend against flying things, and these are flying, right? Oh, what a jerk. Okay, maybe I misunderstood. If a card bearing the sigil will block an opposing creature bearing... You, 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 this. Oh, it has to be the same. It doesn't jump to defend. It just... Okay. My bad. Doesn't matter. I think you're dead. Give me damn teeth. What are you? You won't find better pelts within a hundred miles. On the house. You give me a wolf pelt. I forgot, he did mention that. The pelts give them to the traitor. What is a mushroom? Oh, we have a sigil fight though, or whatever that is. Not a sigil fight, but you know, the the, the totem. Totem! Behold my totem! We'll go to the mushroom, even though we'll have a totem fight. I know I could have found, like, another fire and continued my testing, but that mushroom land, you know, something new. You found yourself among a grove of thick and pungent mushrooms. You squinted to see a figure through a thick cloud of spores. We are the mycologists, yes? Yes. Oh, God, he's got two heads. And we are performing our experiments far from, from, we are not welcome elsewhere. We will experiment on your flock, yes. We, we will need two of the same creatures, one for each of us. Oh, oh dear, you, you don't, you have no duplicate cards. Take one of ours. We will use it next time. Sweet. Bull. The inevitable maggot, they will lurch forth from your hand when creatures are killed. Cool. Or a wolf pelt. 
Yo, let's take another wolf pelt, dude. Alright, so mushroom man, we need duplicate cards. Ah, it's moles. Mantis god. Yes, he does have flight. Let's go. Well, no way am I not playing that, then. Which deals three damage on a post. Wow, that's a jerk move. Ah, my man just got. That's fair. The wardrobe. Hmm. Stink bug. Oh, he's flight. Okay. I will kill an adder. Sure. Oh, he has flight! Uh, does he still kill me? No, if he has zero attack, okay. Uh, he, he does poison, but he even got zero attack. I was curious. But that's good. Uh, let's play... I don't think we've played against someone opposite a sigil yet, so let's try that. See if they copy sigils. All right. Because it did say somewhere on there something about sigils. ILS. But okay, just, just. The Rattler. This is a good battle, eh? Stope. Uh, let's kill that adder guy. Emergency Squirrel. Keep me alive. I'm trying. I like that I have flight and this guy has zero attack. He's just never getting to play. Corpse Maggot. Oh, Corpse Maggot is flight. It's a it's a mantis. Cool. Ooh, Rattler is doing three damage here, guy. Should be careful about that. <clears throat> hey, he was a mole. Thank goodness. Yeah, Elder Stoke, baby! That's fine. Let the squirrel die. Oh, you jerk. Okay, I guess I'll play my bullfrog then. I was gonna say, I wanted to let my corpse maggot fly out of my hand. Get owned. No, my stink bug. All right, get owned. Get super owned. Look at all the teeth, dude. Oh, this is a linear path. Oh, I get another. I get another half of a totem. That's cool. Bullfrog. The industrious beaver, when played, it constructs dams adjacent to it. Okay. The in inviolable beehive. When it is attacked, you will draw. You will draw a bee. So when a card is bearing the sigil is played, a dam is created on each empty adjacent space. Two health. Okay. Oh, is that why these guys have little mushrooms? Because that's that's for the mushroom men. Once a card bearing the sigil is struck, a bee is, a bee is defined as. One power, one health, airborne. Do they cost? Are bees free? I assume bees are free. I forget. Let's take a beehive, though. Another half a totem, though. Sick. Maybe? After an overlong moment of silence, she ought, she moved to offer her carvings. Uh, Let's do reptiles. Oh, shoot. I choose. 
No, I still want this guy. Okay, so I can only have one totem? Okay, that's fair. Yeah, okay. I thought I'd get a second one or something. I still can change them, which is cool. Could I, like, change it mid... No. That's alright. Speaking of totems, we got a totem fight. Eagle burning. Oh, that's a stinky mound. I get one less attack. Me again. Hello. So, Kingfisher. <clears throat> oh, a sparrow. Oh. Don't move your hands. I hate that they all fly, because if I put a wolf pelt down, they're just kind of like... You know, they're just going to be chilling. Keep me alive. I can't sacrifice it. They're not going to attack it because they're all flights. Oh, this one's not. Oh, and they're freaking... Oh, shoot. Am I dead? Oh, okay, at least... I don't see how I live, frankly. Oh, wait, this isn't a boss fight, though. I gotta take a card. Beehive? Flight? I should have taken the beaver, built the dam. They all have flight. This sucks. I'm going to deal one damage because they're, they're stinky and they're jerks. Well, that's not going to do it. Uh, this was a boss battle. Still got one candle. When will the worthy challenger appear? Yo, this I don't I'm not built for flight. A cockroach? A beehive? Pronghorn? Woe be to those that meet the end of its antlers. So you move to the right. And you do that. You do cost two. Take a pronghorn, try that out. We get another totem half. Offer me your carvings. Honestly, I might want the mantises to be stinky. Give me stinky mantis. I think I want that instead of flying mantises. All right. Have we made it to the boss of this? There's a rotting fish. Oh, yeah, it's a fishy man. Oh, fish. I don't get smoke, though. Oh god, I got freaking... And they all fly, dude! I don't want to play a wolf belt. Literally all I can do is play a squirrel. They all fly, man. So like if I... I can't even play a pelt to die, because then it just... And that does have one attack. And fly Kingfisher's in the water, so he just be chilling. He took it. Okay. Well, at least it has zero attack. Haha, -ha, jerk. 
Oh my god! Alright, having pelts is a terrible thing. What if I play a pelt? Haha, <laughs> you still have zero attack, jerk. Do I have any items? Dude, I can't. I got a tooth, I don't think that's gonna matter. I think I'm just dead, man. Yeah, I can't say. I was like, oh, if it's the mirror, dude, I can at least do something there. I don't got no bone chips. Yeah. And Bullfrog would be so good because he can defend against the flying. At least on one lane. So that would have been nice. I don't got no... Here, let me blow out my candle. Just, Just click it. No fish. Oh! Get your hands away from me, guy. Your death card. Beautiful. Though it could use some detail. Choose a card to make the cost from. Well, definitely one. Power and health? Oh, that sucks. And I guess a 1-2. Mm. Now choose a card from which we will extract the sigils. I gotta go triple, boy. Oh, yeah, sigils. Yeah, I don't care about movement. Like, it's probably, you know, fine, but I don't fully understand it. I never did ask you your name. Uh, my name is, uh, Lenny. Any good card has a portrait. Ba 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 ba. Goodbye. No. Probably need to beat the fisherman to for the stink bug to remember anything. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Is this the puzzle? It is a puzzle! 0521 Left, up, third, two, five. Two, one, three. I'm still thinking about the last. Whoa! Be so soundly defeated by the simpleton angler, no less. Hold on. No, 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 no. Here's your deck. Okay, we can. Uh, does the stone always have a rectangular head? Am I losing my mind? Uh. It was here. Oh no. What? Weren't there five? Oh god, am I. Am I really that bad? Oh, it says there's freaking five. How can I get five when there's four? What the frick? No, one was in the bottom. Were you up here? No. Even my character, he had dialogue. He said, whoa. It said two out of five, but there's only four things. I don't understand. Uh... Get out of here. Oh. Oh, whoa, 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 did I get over there? I'm clicking too much. What happened? I can't use that right now? Okay, sorry. Oh, sick. I'm cheating. I 
got a card. Hold on. Squirrel and beehive. Why why are they here? Why are just squirrel and beehive here? Here's a safe. I click a new uh thing. Nothing down there. Clock. In the clock with three hands. Mighty elite sure, whatever. I I got a card? No? Shoot. Alter deck. Oh, what, 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 what? This was five at one point. Was that like secret cards? There's no new cards here. That one's only. Oh. I was clicking too fast, man. Uh, definitely we'd have to do this one first but in the painting there were only like five and even this thing says you know zero out of five so like how it doesn't have to do with the positioning it has to do with positioning because here is zero out of five and here is two out of five, and I only changed one thing. So it's, it's, I mean, I guess it could. Oh! I feel bad. I feel like that's cheating. I didn't really do anything. <laughs> I forgot that I put that there very well. You may add it to your deck and I'll deal with I'll deal you one every so often. Oh maybe that was what the other thing said. I'll deal me one every so often. What do you do though? Well that's confusing though. Why is it just all on the same thing? Well you're stuck there. Alright, no way I'm just gonna like finagle my way into getting that one, so Why was this 5 out of 5, though? You probably get lucky with just guessing this one, I, I suppose. We're going to need to progress, though, for the stink bug to tell me how to do this one, because there's there's no way I'm, I, I can guess that one and just get lucky. Anyway, I think we'll call it a video for now. We did some stuff, but I got one other card that uh, accidentally... Which, again, I feel a little bit bad about. Well, I got two cards accidentally. One I was just clicking and I didn't even see what I got. Uh, we'll call it a video for now. So thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, leave a comment. Why not subscribe as well? It's greatly appreciated. And it's free, so that's cool. Once again, thank you all for watching. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. See ya!